really know how to get around this, guys. I have to take this super hot water, or I just have to take this water that's being pumped up here and get it all the way up there. This is sad indeed. All right, let's connect this. I don't really want to contaminate that thing, but I have to. Yeah, I, this is, I, I, I can work this one. The problem here is that, look at the germs, man. If I start pumping this in, then we're gonna be getting food poisoning. Air can be made from germ water, no problem. Okay. I need drinking water though, still. Like, that's the other problem, is like this. Yeah, okay, I'm just gonna reconnect them because we're in problems and people are gonna start getting sick. But. People are going to die otherwise. Build a farm. What does a farm do? How's a farm going to help this system? Like a way, way bigger farm. Somewhere where CO2 collects. CO2 was collecting right here. And they... Oh, yeah, okay. I, I get what you're saying. Where I stop having to use water for my food creation. I got you. I am going to reconnect this for now. Let's see. Hold on. But we can start doing that. So we'll connect this, which is then going to go up here. We'll just dump it into this... Uh, this line I actually need it to I just needed to go into the line I guess and then I can turn this back on and you guys can start using this water for now and yeah, we need to start building a farm where CO2 gathers. CO2 is here, but it's super unbre- like, it's too hot. This area is cold enough. I think. How, how hot does, uh... Where are they at? They like 50 to 86. 50 to 86. So I could remove these algae terrariums right here. Make a little air vent here so that uh, the CO2 can fall here. All right, let's see. Oh wait, this is actually the better spot for CO2. But it's so hot there, that's the problem. Yeah, that's why I couldn't do it there. I can do it here. Food, farm tiles, I can make them hydroponic, but I think these are, are these getting the water they need? They might be, it's hard to tell. Let me get these vent airflow tiles here. No need for hydroponic, okay. So this should let that stuff settle, like the carbon dioxide flow through here. Spam a bunch of normal farm tiles and mealwood.
deconstruct the algae terrariums. Uh, how cold is it over here? We could make some in here if uh, carbon dioxide gathered, which it doesn't. It's so hot in this area. Farm tiles over here. We can farm on this level, but there's so much oxygen that it's not gonna not gonna work. I guess I could pump some of this CO2 over. Wait, I could build a farm in here, I guess. So let's see, deconstruct this thing. We'll build a farm in that little area with a ladder down to it. Uh, let's see, what what is sleep? Uh, do we have a spot where we can look at it? We don't have a tile yet for it. Sleet wheat. There's sleet wheat. How, how do you like here? Stale. They came from the cold, so I assume they like the cold. So we could farm some of them up in the in the ultra cold, probably. All right, so we've got an exosuit thing here. Let's see. Do we have enough to deliver to these? Yeah, I can bring some more wheeze warts, but uh, let's see, where, where, where's a good spot for that? Let's nuke this. We gotta mark more wheeze warts for room picking up. We can go get this one if we dig through here. So that's three wheeze warts we can put them. Make frosty buns? Can I make those? Let's see. Oh, I can just start pumping these things out. Although these are the seeds. I need the seeds for... Can you plant sleet wheat grain or do they just... How does this work? Are these harvested? We're harvesting... Oh yeah, we need to open these. Submit bioscan, submit bioscan. Sleet, wheat, grain are both seeds and cooking mats. Okay, so I need to... I need to plant some more of them. Do they just grow in regular farm plots or do I need to have a... Hydroponic... Sleet wheat. They want air pressure, they want body temperature to be cold, they want oxygen, polluted oxygen, and carbon dioxide. Growth, growth halted based on pressure. Additional growth, they want fertilization and irrigation. So they would like irrigation, they would like fertilization. So regular farm tiles covers that potentially, right? Hydroponic would work as well because I could just send this this water through there, or just build like a the farm along this pipe here. Okay, so let's build a hydroponic farm up here using our pipes that we're pumping water through. Uh, 
Uh, we can do something like this. Put another little ladder there. So they should be able to plant sweet weed up there. These need to have uh, mealwood, is what we were making, right? No liquid. Oh, these are hi I didn't need hydroponic down here, did I? Oh, I made it just because there was water coming over here anyway, so. Let's bring the plumbing down here. There we go. So here's our carbon dioxide. Oh yeah, and we wanted to build one over here. So let's drop ladder down here. Let's build, cause this is temperature controlled and it's got carbon dioxide. So let's just build regular farm tiles over here. We get these things built. Gro growth halted atmosphere. This plant is immersed in water. Oh, okay. I hate when it says atmosphere and it's just the water thing because I get super confused thinking that it's not enough pressure or whatever. Uh, okay, so we can plant a little planter up here. Flower pot right there. We can put a plant, a little flower pot on the other end here. Let's destroy this building. Alright, Orc Lord Dave, man. Hey, it's, it's always good seeing you. Thanks for the help. Hope to see you again soon. see put a planter there so we'll try and get these things cooled so that they can actually produce again if they can produce then that's good news for us how's our temperature looking still very warm over here as it kind of should be. Dude, I wonder if uh, if I should have been... I should maybe look at building some of these thermal... Tiles. Insulated tiles. Reduces heat transfer between tiles. Like, I should maybe be building... Some layers of this to try to keep some of this heat out. I think that that might be a good idea to start doing, like, abyssalite this. Maybe throw another layer of abyssalite, like, here. Abyssalite this. Just try to prevent some of this heat from getting in. Because this heat is coming from largely, like, down here. Farm tiles, no seeds selected, meal wood. Let's, uh, copy the settings here. We need to get rid of this water now, though. 
building lacks resources. Our people are going to start... Oh, yeah, here we go. Our people are getting... Immune systems are getting hit. Insufficient oxygen generation. Okay. Copy settings. Apply it to these. Pressure damage. Too much liquid? Shoot. Okay, I need to... I need to use like a mesh thing here. Because these are not going to do well with that liquid in there. Pressure difference. Okay, you're building here. You're doing. You're gonna be building here, but we need to clear that water out. Did they ever open these doors? Nope, not yet. He's working on it. Maybe. Okay. Do I not? Ha I don't have enough room. Probably. Is the thing. Hydroponic farm. Sleep wheat. There it is. Let's make our little hydroponic farms all the way across here. Get as many little hydroponic farms in here as we can. Sleet wheat. Growth halted op atmosphere. Oxygen polluted oxygen. Carbon dioxide. Oh, it's all hydrogen. Hydrogen, hydrogen, hydrogen. Um, shoot. That's going to be a bummer for my stuff. I guess I need a little... They wanted what? Oxygen? Polluted oxygen or carbon dioxide? And why is this generator idle? What is going on in my little place? Things are not being done the way I expect them to. Oh, they did sweep up the stuff. Where's our... Uh... Did you get that suit? Where are you, buddy? Ari Ashcan. I'm looking for my boy non fat in here. Darth Cajun's right there. There's non fat. Are you wearing your suit? Doesn't look like you have any sort of special suit. You had it assigned to you. But. Equipment. Where was it put? Who took it? I need to know these questions. Yeah, I, I don't know what happened because I assigned it to you, but... Uh, but things, uh, things seem to not go our way. We probably should assign some separate people to these exosuit docks. 
Flower pot waiting for delivery. Can we mop this stuff up? There we go. Thank you, little mesh tile, for getting rid of a lot, enough water there so that we could clean this up and these things could start growing. Wait, why is more water coming in here? Is that just because we're irrigating it? I don't understand what's happening. Where is this water actually coming from? I'm so confused about the mythical water generation here. So where did our clothing get put, actually? Also, are we out of coal? Oh god, we're out of coal. Things suddenly became very bad for our, uh, our colony. We are out of coal. Iron ore, everything. My, my place is going to fail if there's no coal. That's pretty much... Uh, that's pretty much it. So this may actually be the end of our little, uh, our little colony of Savoryville. There's some coal over here. But this isn't going to save me for very long. Oh, I didn't mean to do it like that. No! I wanted a priority nine. Uh, where are my hatches at? Yeah, because I... They should... There's some hatches down here. Is there a way to get them stuff? There's hatches there. Are there any hatches inside my base? I don't think there are hatches in my base anymore, but... Uh, there's hatches in the bathroom. Or a hatch in the bathroom. Build some compactors with them, fill the box, then empty the box, they eat the stuff on the- okay. So... Okay. Let's build a compactor out here. I could lock this- I could lock them in this room and do exactly what you're saying there. So like I could just build a... wall here. Have a... a door go in there. Everything is in bad shape right now if I don't get this coal thing going. So let's cancel this storage compactor now, but I want to, uh... I need to stop these here. I need to put a wall so that they stop. Or I guess I can put a door first. 
Pneumatic door right. Manual airlock here. Priority nine. Cause I wanna I need to break these tiles so that I can start using this path. Now let's build tiles in here. Okay, and then we can deconstruct this so that the door... They hop on top of the door. I could put an algae thing there above them and then have a have it just I think the slime doesn't slime fall through like the mesh drops <clears throat> I forget if that works or not because if you could do like an algae thing and have just slime drop down on top of them nothing falls through okay Finish building this stuff so that I can break this wall. I don't want my people to die. Uh, this coal can be picked up. Coal. Ladder. Okay, so if he goes and builds the... We have to let somebody through. No, they'll figure it out. Once we de deconstruct this. No, he's in my base! Okay, stay out of my base. Okay. This can be everything once again. Actually, I could send only polluted stuff in here, and they could eat the polluted stuff. Uh, where's that polluted? Organic, polluted dirt. Because all my other ones I don't supply polluted dirt with. No, they're free now. Now they're in my base. I guess I can just open this here. Open this manual hair lock. And then, is there, can you just dump this out now? Is there a way to just dump? If they, if I disable the building, will it dump? I put some polluted stuff in there and I just want them to start eating it. Oh, what? You just make it so... Okay. There we go. So now there's polluted stuff in there. Eat the polluted dirt. Eat it. Ha ha! This is a good way to get rid of polluted dirt, too. So now I need to tell this to be... You, you can drop polluted dirt in here. Uh, organic polluted dirt. You know, oh yeah, that's a good idea. Put him in the bathroom. 
I do have one in this bathroom, but it's the, uh, this is the upgraded bathroom, so that's not as good. But just messing with these hatches did kind of fix my coal problem. So, catching hatches, that's an important thing, early colony development. Um, I've learned about the whole copper thing, like, you can undo your copper thing, so even if copper is a limited resource and you built your base out of it, you can recover that, which is good news. I wasn't sure if I was screwed or not. Uh, here, oh, there's a bunch of coal over here, too. So, coal is back on the table. But we are getting actually very sick from our our lack of whatever. Why is this... Why is there continually water down here? Can I deconstruct and drop this down there? Why is there also a security door here? That seems... Weird. Right, let's put a mesh tile back here after we've deconstructed that thing so that all this water can just flow. But this farm is basically screwed because they keep... Like, water keeps... Water keeps just appearing on top of the farm tiles. Where is this water all coming from? I... I am at a loss here at where myth, this magical... water is coming from. Is it because it's... No, I, I have no clue. And it and because of this, this farm is worthless. Oh, pressure damage? Is it the plumbing? Wait, there's no plumbing. What, what, what got pressure damage? Dig out below it and see what happens? Okay. Um. Water two... Oh, 2,000 kilograms of water in this thing. <laughs> Normal water is normally 1k max. Okay. So let's see if we can figure this out. Yeah, this tile is just getting screwed too. Is there a water generator or something under here that's just not... ...not being shown? Suffocating. Dude, can you get out of there? Priority 9? 
Priority nine. Oh, look at all this water that just popped out of here. Well, that fixed it. That was a really bizarre problem. I don't know how that, that tile got so much water compressed. But now this farm can function. Can we deliver these things so we can get these tiles maybe functional? There's that food poisoning coming along. My colony's looking in rough shape right now, honestly. It's got some things going for it, but it's still, you know, it's still very, uh, very rough right now. Can I change this to be making... Yeah, we can make a bunch of these. Pepper breads. Let's make some frost buns. Did this thing ever start working? No. It didn't. There's problems up here. These want... Uh, they want atmosphere, not hydrogen. So I need to, like, pump hydrogen out of here. I don't really know how I would do that other than just by building another power plant. Of hydrogen variety. Let's see. Hmm. I don't know. I think I may be at a point where uh, I might call it a night. Well, our colony is in okay shit. Like, we, we are kind of recovering in some aspects. We figured out, you know, the hatches can solve some of our coal issues. We've got... Man, our, our temperature is still problems. Even with these Weezworts, it's so hot around here. We're layering this area with Weezwort and it doesn't, doesn't matter. So heat management is something that I definitely need to learn how to deal with. Non-fat, I, 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 heat management is still my like, I don't know. It's my weakness right now. I do have a lot of heat producers next to them. That's very true. This, All these machines are pumping out a bunch of heat. All that stuff's going on. I need to focus on... So I think in a new colony... Yeah, so that's... I was thinking that. I was thinking that try to put power stuff way away from my colony... That's a good idea if I just have a little little power production area. Another thing I think I really need to work on if I start a new colony is I need to get farms going with CO2 usage instead of using like carbon skimmers. Like this carbon skimmer is getting rid of a lot of stuff. Who's suffocating? We're in bad sh We're actually... We are running low on oxygen throughout this whole thing. So. This this run may be basically at its, 
it's it seems like it's at its final kind of moments. We learned a lot. We did a lot. I could probably keep it going, but I might start like a new one instead at some point in like in a, a next stream or something like that. Not positive. I learned a lot. I think I did a lot of things decently in the setup here, but everything's very clustered tightly. I didn't put a lot of planning into where things were going. I just kind of threw them wherever. It, at the time, things kind of made sense, but it just looks like a mess right now. <laughs> I probably should clear more space for my place, but the problem is with that is like... Uh, that makes it very hard to generate all the oxygen I need. If I have like a really spread out base. But yeah, I think I'm I think this place is about to reach a, reach a catastrophic end and I'd really not like to let it reach that catastrophic end. So I'm going to save right now. I'm going to exit this match. I, I I might leave this this place uh and not, not let all my friends here die. <laughs> and just uh, start a new colony up next time. So, Hey man, Nonfat, it's been good uh, having you in here. Everybody else who's watching right now, good having you. Uh, I'd like to see you guys again. I'll be streaming on probably Saturday. What is today, Thursday? Today is Thursday, right? Yeah. Or today is Friday now, I guess. But I'll be streaming on Saturday, so uh, yeah. Good seeing y'all. Have a great night, and I hope to see you again soon.